Once you hit your 60s, it's time to make sure your wellness is top priority. Many health conditions become more common at this age, including heart disease and certain types of cancer. It's never too late to make changes to your routine to ensure a healthier life as you age. Here's a rundown of screenings I wish all women in their 60s would prioritize. You should get your blood pressure tested every one to two years, even if you've never had high blood pressure before. It starts creeping up after menopause, so it's important to get checked. High blood pressure increases your risk of heart disease and stroke, but starting treatment can reduce the risk. Maintaining a healthy weight and reducing your intake of sugar-sweetened beverages like soda can help to prevent health problems down the line. Your cholesterol level may also start rising by your 60s, Menopause can cause harmful LDL cholesterol and triglycerides to increase. Have your cholesterol checked every five years. Your doctor may suggest more frequent screenings if you have other risk factors. In your 60s, you should continue getting tested for diabetes about every three years or more frequently if you have other diabetes risk factors. By this point, you've likely already started screenings for breast cancer and colorectal cancer. Continue getting a mammogram every one to two years until age 75. For colon cancer, you will likely get a colonoscopy every 10 years at least, depending on your risk factors and previous screenings, a sigmoidoscopy every five years, and a stool-based test done yearly. If you are a smoker or used to smoke, talk to your doctor about lung cancer screening. Quitting smoking at any age is usually one of the best things you can do to take control of your health. What about cervical cancer? Well, starting at age 65, you may stop getting pap tests as long as you've had three normal tests within the past 10 years, and if you have not had cervical cancer or pre-cancer in the past. Years of sun damage can accumulate, which is why mole checks and skin cancer screening are important for women in their 60s. Each year, more people get a skin cancer diagnosis than all other cancers combined. A new test you should get around age 65 is a bone density test, which checks for risk of osteoporosis. If you have a history of fractures or other risk factors, your doctor may suggest starting this test earlier. Getting vision checks are important at this age. It might be harder to see things close up, for example, and you might need to start wearing glasses or change your prescription. You may also be prone to vision problems if you have diabetes, a family history of glaucoma, or take certain medications. Get your eyes examined every one to two years. Don't neglect your teeth. You should go to the dentist for an exam and cleaning at least once a year. Twice a year is even better. Finally, don't forget about vaccines. Your kids and grandkids aren't the only ones who need shots. If you haven't gotten it yet, your doctor may recommend two doses of the herpes zoster vaccine to prevent shingles, as well as the pneumococcal vaccines. You should continue getting an annual flu shot and the tetanus diphtheria booster every 10 years. Take the time to make those doctor appointments and stay up to date with health screenings.